Ladies and gentlemen, I have the privilege right now, okay, to have a man that's been in the game, been doing this since when I started in the game on SL in 2007. I got DJ Fallon in the building, y'all, making a rare appearance right here on oh, Fresh Air Talk Show. Yo, you smell that? Oh. <laughs> Fresh That's air, fresh air. Show, baby, it's your man DJ Fallon, Hit Mix Squad represent Hit Mix ninety six FM. Fresh air, what it do, smooth. Ten years in SL is like sixty years in real life. Your avatar starts to break down. Damn! You start wondering, do I have that swag anymore? But thanks to my friends at Whatever Teeth, I got my swagger back, and you know I'm ready to roll. Thanks, whatever, Teeth. It's a privilege to have you here, man. That's that's just real talk. Oh, man. it's an honor. It's an honor for me to sit in this studio, man. This is fresh air, baby. Talk show, man. Come on, man. I got the original note card from back in the day, from when it came up. They're like, man, DJ Fallon, I got this idea, son. What is it, man? What is it? Let's do a talk show. And boom, I'm sitting right here. Fresh air talk show. That's what I'm talking about, baby. That's right. Hey, man, I so just want to put it to you like this. All right? Now, you've seen so much mm -hmm. in the game on SL. I mean, we're talking going back to 2007 with this, right? Right. Okay. So, yep. my question yeah. to you because, is this. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it was 2007. I came in 2006 with Sonny B. Right. She was the one okay. that brought me over. Yep. Right. Right. So we're talking 2007. That's true. The difference in the game right now from back in 2007. Your opinion. What you think? My opinion. Okay. From 2007 to now. Wow, man. As far as the DJ game is concerned, man. Back in the day, it was nothing but hit mix squad across the board, man. It was entertainment value. It was kicking. If it wasn't hit mix in the building, DJ Fallon in the building, Club Insatiables, baby, big shout out to the hit mix squad. It wasn't happening anywhere else. You know what I'm saying? So what what I'm trying to say with that is, is that from the come up, from the from the ground up, and hey, look, ground level radio, the come up from the ground up. Right. It was all about entertainment. You know what I'm saying? It's it's what you can bring to the table. And we brought a show. We were DJs. We were we were kicking it. We were just back in the day, man. It was just old school flavor to that to that music. And we was it was just a vibe. And boom, DJ Fallon. Let, yo, can I? Yeah, come on, man. You coming with the squad? Boom, can I come? I never said no to anybody. You know what I'm saying? True. That's true. But then here's the difference too. The way things was ran at that time right so oh, right yep so let's put it like this we talked about this earlier and you can tell the difference okay when djs yes, was part of hit mix okay right. we was able to be djs we was able to be artists we didn't have to be concerned with the lindens because you guys right. took care of us if you had a hit mix tag and shout outs to dj may may you know, May Mayla Pay. Forsella. DJ Missy Pay. Missy right? Is she in the building? Yeah, she in the studio right now. But the difference yeah. was we had that hit mix tag. You wanted a hit mix DJ. You had a price tag you had to pay. But. Right. But. Right. Right. But. but. There's this whole only word we was using earlier. But. Right. But you were getting quality you had to show DJ. me your shit. You had. You had to know the game. Exactly. Nope. There it is. There it is, right? C certain type of swag. You had to, you had to show us as a squad, or what you was bringing to the table. Now, I'm not talking about what you can bring to the club. That's the difference. Right. You know, the difference today is, is that anybody can go to the club. You know what I'm saying? Right. Nowadays, if it, back in the day, if you were going to the club, who's DJing? <laughs> Who else? The Hit Mix Squad. Represent. Right. You know what right. I mean? But. Th that's the difference. The difference now and between then, that's what you were saying, between now and then. Man, it, it's just a jump, man. It's just a whole different turn, a curveball straight down the quarter pocket, and people are swinging at it, and they're striking out, man. You feel what I'm saying with that? I do. I do, man. But that's the difference, though. Think about it. Come on. Let's look at it this way, okay? So, 
back in the day, we didn't have auto DJ. So no, we did not. If you had a squad like Hit Mix, you came onto the squad. Okay, so first you had to do X amount of sets. You couldn't just walk on and do a set. Now you got a tag. So you had to do X amount of sets, and then right. once you got your tag. You still didn't have choice of what schedule you had. Now, based on your real life, you you may got stuck with a, you know, eleven to one in the morning, right. okay, or right. a it's two a, to yeah. four yeah. or something like that, right? Yeah, because you had yeah. DJs yeah. across the grid, worldwide, you know, so you could fill that gap. So we didn't have yeah. auto DJ to just play the music and you be off doing something else, right? And then you had troopers and soldiers like Mela, DJ May May, who fall yeah. asleep on the keyboard because she playing for six hours straight. You know what I'm saying? Yo, where's May May at? Yo, wake up. The show is over, man. <laughs> exactly. Right. She was just there. Right. She was just there, and that's dedication. You see, and brings it back to, to 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 where everybody's at now, to where I'm at, to where you're at, to where she's at, to where everybody's at now is dedication, and hard work. We had to put in work, man. It wasn't. It's not like you know we can turn on a switch and say, "Hey, thanks everybody for coming out. Thank you for your tips. Whatever you want to say, bloop. Turn on the auto DJ, and guess what? Until the next time, listen to this. We didn't have that. We had right. seven, eight hour shows, man, of lot nothing but live entertainment. That's what kept it live. <laughs> but here's the deal look at the new djs now right so i'm a mm. dj i get in the game i go pick up a stream which you know you and i both know just to have a stream was like you know big you know what i'm saying that was big just having a stream yeah that was big that was okay. big because back in the day the streams were not cheap Right, I mean, they're not cheap, you know. Big shout out to Neo Streams, man, because that's who I was with for years. I mean, if it wasn't for Neo Streams, that was one of the first stream centers that you had to go to, and they was five k, six k. I think the prices is still the same because they the empires, wow. and they can charge whatever they want because they was the first ones to do it. Right, so they can charge you that, you know. They have that empire. Right. But see, nowadays with the whole DJ game, we don't have that empire because it's like you said, it's switched off to just DJ after DJ after DJ. You know, it, it, it's just been a it's, it's come to a complexity to where if you're not a, a mixed DJ, you can't get in the spot because we have. No, no, no. We're cool because we got this guy or, 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 or this woman over here and, and, and we're, we're happy with that. And then we could just turn on the auto DJ. We're cool. Right. You know, right. But then, too, you also brought in the advertising aspect, right? Oh, right. Yeah. yeah that was another the, big the piece back. that you brought in, you know? Yeah. Commercializing. So. Yeah. Get, getting people on commercials and uh, just advertising businesses and what people on their creative aspects on, on clothing lines. Uh, who else was I advertising? Just clubs. Club after club was really good, you know, on advertising because it wasn't that many clubs. It was Insatiables and you had Bootylicious and then you had, you know, a DJ Cotton Mouse Club, uh, right. Indica. You know, it, it was just certain places to where that they had DJs all around the clock. So, Man, man, has that changed? Boy, has that changed right. forever, man? Right. But then too, I mean, it's just like the game is so different. So let's just talk about it. DJs back then, you had tricks, you had your scratching, you had your doubling up, you had the right. blend, you had Bring the mix, in, the blends. You know? Yep. Right. Now, you had to. Yeah, now yeah, DJ so and so can just talk throughout the damn song, or can pretty <laughs> much. Good, I'm just saying. Or, or no, I'm saying it's the damn truth, <laughs> right? It's the damn or, truth, and you ain't lying about that, right? Uh, or, hell, or you want DJ Fallon to come through and say, "Yo, yo, what's good? This is DJ Fallon, the legendary DJ Fallon, right here." As a matter of fact, let me play a song real quick. <laughs> right. Hey, yo, what's good? This is DJ Fallon back at you again. Right. Hey guys, right. you could do that all day. Yep. But then on top of that, day. oh, I'm not gonna mix some. Let me just spin the record back. And then bring in the new song, different tempo. Didn't yeah. even move with the song that you had before, but you hot. I mean, come on, you know where's the interaction? Right. We talked about that offline. The interaction of the DJ with the crowd, making you want to come back, making you feel welcome when you at that club. Right. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, yeah. It, it was all about what made Hitmix very popular is the crowd motivation. We motivated people to stay in their seats because they could have easily, as I said, turned off the computer and went to a real club and said, I got a real DJ right here. Right. You know, I paid ten, fifteen dollars to get into a club and I'm motivated right now. I'm dancing, I'm jamming, I'm drinking to so the point that where we save people that ten, fifteen dollars, they came and they had that entertainment right at their fingertips. Log right. on a second life. Come chill with Hitmix or, or, or come to the club and let us motivate you let us entertain you we were that entertainment value of, of what second life had as one of the first radio streams to do it in second life so that was our main concern is to keep people entertained and and, and that's what that's where the value is getting lost at brother no i agree i totally agree so now it's our duty as you know true heads true lovers of the game to Empire. pretty much entrepreneurs, take over. right? Right. <laughs> yeah, man. And, and it's funny you said that because when we actually did this shit, the takeover show, um, you know, we had 15. This is something we haven't talked about yet. We had 15 locations back to back to back. It was a 15 hour show, the biggest show, Second Life, that I think that's ever done. As far as Hitmix is concerned, right. a 15 hour show was called the Takeover Show. Sunny B was in it. I believe May May was in it. You know, if not, she was there. She knew about it. You right. know, it was DJ G Rock. Shout out to my brother DJ G Rock. Let's let's do that real quick. Shout out DJ May May. Shout out to sexy DJ Sunny B. Let me get the name right. B smooth. DJ B smooth. You know, uh, G Rock, DJ G Rock, my Rastafari right. brother, man. Like, uh, you know, all the the Hit Me Squad DJs, even DJ Kane Wise was there with us. You know what I'm saying? Like, it it, it was just the entertainment. We loved it. We loved the, the the fact of that as a takeover. It's our jobs as true entertainers, as the ones that can get you out of your seat and not just say hit play and say here's the song I want you to dance to it. Right. It's our jobs, it's, as you said, smooth. It's our jobs as entrepreneurs and entertainers to, to bring back that value to where I want to be in Second Life. Second Life is not dead. Hip hop in Second Life is not dead. And that's my pain. My pain is, is that Second Life DJing has died off a little bit. You oh, know what sure. I'm saying? It, 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 it's in the dirt a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it's starting to cover itself up. So it's our jobs as, as, as the originators to originally entertain the people for their for their value they we have to let them know that there's still that entertainment mark in here and i'm just gonna put it out there this is the first and oh, only yeah. show that you're gonna test years. dj fallon on first and nine only. years i've never done it there you i've never go. done it nobody's ever asked me you know nobody's ever said i wonder what dj fallon thinks or you know i wonder if i can just sit him down one day and say no right here on fresh air talk show can't come That's up right. show man o originally yo it, it, i'm telling you, true honor to be sitting in the studio like like i said when i came in here i thought i was in trouble i'm in my office i'm like wait a second <laughs> my, am i seriously in trouble right. i'm back at home baby what's going on what is this fresh right. air talk show and i'm sitting here right with my man be smooth man much respect for that yeah man i i appreciate it man and and, and i'm gonna just put it out there like this because nowhere else does anyone else do this but i'm gonna put it out there i want to give mad shout outs to all the radio stations that have a focus that oh, have sure. a vision that's doing something what radio um honey what? 103 what? you know what i'm saying what radio honey? exactly yeah right? honey radio you know why because I remember opening and closing the Metropolitan Club. DJ Smoke is still doing it. Shout out to yes. What Radio, baby. Yes. Because he's had clubs on top of clubs and he has never stopped. That's the motivation. Never stop. Shout out to all the radio stations that are here and now. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, it, it, it's a network, baby. This is what we're supposed to do. Well, you know, funny. I'm going to tell wasn't you like this, him, though. It wouldn't be for you as, as, as a culture that we wanted to provide to you. Shout out to all the radio stations and even radio stations that we don't know about. Right. You know what I'm saying? But put it like this. I'm going to tell you never like done this. It. We've never done that. You know, because you mentioned it makes strictly. But right. you mentioned, though, done. Fallon, check this out. You mentioned smoke and yes. you mentioned the network, right? Smoke CeeLo, right. I had just got the hit mix tag. I was rolling with hit mix. And DJ Smoke, Turtle. I'll and put it out exactly. there. DJ Turtle. Smoke CeeLo, DJ Turtle said, I got this club. 
I got Tuesdays open. Only one thing. You got to come in your socks and draws. And Tuesdays was socks and draws night at the Metropolitan. Socks and draws. And we rocked it. <laughs> Two hours. I did one. He did the other. And dude, I'm serious. It was crazy. Right? Yeah, but it was popular. And he gave me a, he gave me a shot. And I mean, it's like, it's networking. Here we are. I got yeah. ground level radio. He's got what's what radio. He has another shout branch of what radio. radio. Honey radio. Shout out to Wheezy Radio. There you go. You know, I think that old school station was uh, 97 1. Shout out to them. Right. You know right. what I mean? Right. So you can see the offspring from. Because it came, it came from one 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 entertainment value to where where it stuck through through the Hit Mix Squad and they, Hit Mix ninety six FM. You know they 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 knew that that wow we like something like that. Let's give them back that same thing. Let let let's bring it up. Let's do the same thing. And that's what I love about it. I don't hate it. And that's what some people think that oh DJ Fallon has Hit Mix. He hates it. I fucking love it. You can take the F without. I said it. I fucking love it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, I'm put I love, it like I love this. to see radio. I'm going to put it like this. I want to give mad shout outs to all the sponsors. I've been getting calls in, IMs, offline messages. How do I get my logo on that board? All you got to do is contact me, Bryson Capellini. I will make sure it happens. Right now, it's all on the love. So send me the logos. Tell people about the show. Okay? If you want to be on the show, contact me. You know? Right now, SL is so divided, especially it's divided. in our community, right? So you're not, it's, you're like, not. it's like it's, it's like this, true. man. Oh, I want to be the best DJ. I'm gonna be the hottest DJ, but I'm gonna be talking about this DJ. I'm not gonna support this DJ. I go to every DJ's event. I may not even like you, but I'm gonna go because I'm supporting the cause. I'm supporting you getting up there representing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, and that's what that that's the whole that's the whole purpose of what we had to do again. Going back to the day, it's what we had to do was represent. If right. that's the only thing you know how to do in this world is represent, represent it to the fullest. You know what I'm saying? You that's getting right. up there, you doing your thing, represent it. Right. So, I'm gonna say it like this. Earlier we was talking offline, and you mentioned some yeah. don'ts for club owners. Like if a DJ comes to you and don't have a stream. Don't hire him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah, stuff like that. Him. Let's go over that. Let's go through this one more time, baby. <laughs> let's go through this one more time. To all the club owners out there, yes, this is you, 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 and especially you, okay? <laughs> if a DJ comes to you, and we're not going to say no names. We know who you are already because we know who your peoples are, okay? We know where you're at. We know where you're DJing. If these DJs come up to you and say, hey, can I put my tip jar out first? Do not hire this DJ. He's all about the money. He's not going to exactly. care about the entertainment value for your spot. Right. So ask that shit right there. Reason number two, if a DJ comes up to you and says, oh, hey, wait a minute. I got to go get my stream real quick. I don't have my stream real quick. Do not hire this DJ. He <laughs> wants to come up. He wants to load up his MP3 player. I just want to play some music. Right. Do not hire this DJ. He is not a DJ. She is not a DJ. Right. And rule number three. If a DJ comes up to you and says, um, how many people do you get in your club? Do not hire this DJ. <laughs> He's only worried about himself. Right. Herself. Right. X that motherfucker right there. Right. Because I mean, all we DJ, all around. we do it for the love. It's we do love, it for the love man. of the music. It has to come. It has to come from you. Right. I mean, and I want to give a shout out to the mix DJs, the real mix DJs that I've been, been witnessing. You know, uh, DJ Supreme, aka DJ Mastermind, right? Doing scratch DJ, DJ Crow, real DJ Wax DJ, scratching it up, Man, doing his up. thing. You know, and those are the two DJs that I've seen so far that have the bring ins, the blends, the the, the real ready work. You know. I know DJ May May doesn't scratch a lot, but she knows how to bring shit in. There she knows go. how to work the track. She knows how to let y'all know that, hey, this is coming up. If you have anything that y'all want to hear, let me know. And that's okay to do. Right. So there shout out go. DJ May May. That. That's what I meant you to bring up. That's what I meant to bring right. up. Take right. in requests. Okay. So I've heard DJs who say, oh, nah, I don't take no requests. Well, 
Okay. You so... know why? It's not on their MP3 player. <laughs> it's not on their MP3. And they don't so have I a source to get it, right? <laughs> okay. I can just go ahead. I can go to the stove real quick. Down the right. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, they got it real quick. I'll download it right off the end. There you go. There you yeah. go. I'm I mean, sorry. when I DJ, if you, if you want to hear some Willie Nelson, okay, I'll get it. You know, and find a way to mix it in somehow. Okay. Right. So it's, but it's about the person. Come on. You come into my club or you come into a club. All right. Spending your time supporting the DJ. All you want to hear is good music. And then on top of that, you say, Hey, this is my favorite song. Can you just play it? And they go, uh, no, uh, I'm not taking a request. Uh, <laughs> who's that by? Exactly. Just don't even know the, it's a craft. You need to know your music. You need this is this is a craft. This is not something that you just jump in, buy a stream, and play your like you said your playlist. You know. And to be honest with you, if you're an exclusive DJ like myself, I get a lot of exclusive from a lot of different industry cats because I'm a real life DJ myself too. Right. Uh, and as I said it before, real life and second life same with me. If you have all the exclusive music and people go, man, I haven't heard that before. That was amazing. If the word amazing ever comes out of anybody's mouth, you've done your job exactly. as a DJ, as an entertainer, as a person who cared about their entertainment. I always said, man, if you as a DJ, if you don't have the person on the other end of that screen in real life, tapping their feet, nodding their head, maybe just start dancing or dancing in their chair, you ain't doing your job. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're not doing it. <laughs> so, right. But with that, man, we only got a few minutes left. You want to give out any other shout outs? I'll get my shout outs and we'll call it a wrap. Yeah. But I got to have you back. Yeah. That's all but, I got to say. But I got to have you back. You got to tell me you're going to be back. Oh, man, I'm going to be back. All right. <laughs> Anytime you need me, I'm going to come do the show. I'm going to be back and I'm going to let everybody know. I'm, we're just going to do it like this. I'm going to come back. I'm going to do any show. Any kind of possibility with Fresh Air Talk Show, man. Like I said, this is a true honor. First shout outs coming out to Fresh Air Talk Show DJ B Smooth for coming up and not forgetting about the dream of the entertainment value for the people. I salute you, my friend. Uh, um, I salute you, man. Hit next I time you're welcome. And I want to give mad Great. shout outs. I want to give these shouts out to DJ Sexy C. She do the gospel show on here and she do the Zumba class for Rocker Fit. And she DJ on Ground Level Radio, DJ VIP from Detroit, right. and then of course I want to give mad shout outs on that level, just like like my man DJ Fallon. We got Gary Hines in the UK. I got DJ Doming- Dominguez in Kenya. You know DJ right. has Real One right, right. in Chicago. You know what I'm saying? DJ oh Kiefer yeah. in Vegas, and uh, myself. Hey. So you know what I mean. And hey, I, I, let me get my DJ shout outs in. Big shout out to DJ Sexy Sunny B once again. Probably one of the hottest female DJs ever in Second Life. Yes. Shout out to DJ May May. Probably, probably also one of the hottest D, female DJs in Second Life doing it right now. Shout out to Novel Poppin' J. Shout out to DJ G Rock. Shout out to the Hit Mix Squad DJs and promotions. Everybody that who's ever rocked out of the Hit Mix Squad event. Man, Hitmix 96 FM, everybody that wants to be coming up as a DJ, please learn it the right way. Come talk to us. We're very approachable. We will let you know how it's to be done. Right. And shout out to everybody that just wants to do it the right way. Yeah, man. Works. Shout out to the sponsors, too, man. You have sponsors, right? Shout out to Von no Bitch, doubt. Beauty and Taste for the Tour, Honey, the Fashion. You know what I mean? Shout out to Club Twerk something. Shout out to all the hip hop clubs and R&B clubs that employ us every day. We actually salute you for that too. Without you, it ain't us, man. That's right. No doubt. And man, shout out to all the sponsors. True News, Hot Mix 96, um, Sweet Tart, I Watch News, Rock of Fit. You know, we just got a lot going on right now. So mad props. And my hostess from the Fresh Air Talk Show is not here today. Looking, man, shout outs to you two girls. So, and with that, we out, ladies and gentlemen. That's a wrap with this fresh air for you, baby. That's right.